Well, hello again to all the boys and girls out there in YouTube land watching. Georgia Bear Views back at you today with another one. And I am super psyched about this one from Hobbs Brewing Company out of Ossipee, New Hampshire. This is the Sugar Moon Bourbon Barrel Aged Maple Scotch Ale. This bottle is courtesy of Mr. Bumpy Road Brewery. I really appreciate it. This sounds like it's going to be right up my alley. Bourbon barrel aged maple scotch ale. And a little bit about this beer. Uh, let's see. This beer is brewed in celebration of the thaw. Brewed with maple syrup, candy cap mushrooms. Interesting. And aged in bourbon barrels. So the mushrooms give it, are going to give it like an earthy feel, I think. Then of course the bourbon barrel aging, a base of sweet caramel and toffee flavors with layered notes of maple syrup, figs, and spice. Make this a unique and complex brew. 10% alcohol by volume. It sounds amazing. I hope it lives up to the hype. Okay. Uh, Bumpy Roads channel link in the description below if you haven't already please go check him out he does awesome beer reviews all right there's the poor little thin slightly off-white head which is dissipating very quickly very fizzy pouring it into the glass almost sounded like uh, soda pop, the appearance, very deep caramel, almost like a copper color. It's coming across a lot darker on the screen, but the lighting in here is pretty poor. But it's definitely like a copper color. It is clear. I can see through it. Definitely getting the maple, toffee, caramel. A little bit of the barrel aging. There's some wood character coming through, a little bit of that charred oak. Gosh, it smells incredible. It's like malt lover's dream. Mm. I'm not getting any dark fruit on the nose. Maybe some will come across on the palate. It'll be interesting to see if any of the mushroom caps come into play. Mostly maple syrup, maybe a little brown sugar, the caramel, toffee, that, that roasted malt, along with a little bit of the barrel presence. Uh, none of the alcohol at 10% is coming through, so that's pretty impressive. I am salivating, so without further ado, let's get into this brew. Cheers. Wow. This is really enjoyable. The mushroom comes through on the palate. A definite earthiness from that and a little bit of that mushroom flavor. It just, it works. It may sound strange, but it really works with this beer. So you're getting the malt forward presentation, a little bit of that maple syrup, but definitely some caramel and toffee notes, a little bit of uh, bready notes from the roasted malt. In the middle of the sip, you get the mushrooms coming through. That nice earthy character is coming through uh, with the mushrooms. And then on the finish, it is a little sweet as well, but it drops off pretty quickly. The bourbon barrel aging, I think, kind of helps the lingering effects dissipate very quickly. There's not a, a long lingering finish like you get with some beers like this. The thing that I really like about this beer is the maple notes are coming through, but it's not sticky. It's not cloyingly sweet. There's a nice balance between the maple, the earthy mushroom notes in the middle of the sip. There's some significant malt breadiness as well. A little bit of um, toasted brown bread notes. A little bit of brown sugar kind of comes across on the palate as well. I think that's just from the maple syrup and the way that it's interacting with the other flavors in the beer. It just kind of creates a, a brown sugar type uh, note. 
but it's really not too sweet. It's nicely balanced. There's really no hot bitterness to speak of with this one on the finish. The alcohol is masked very well though, and when you swallow it down, the higher ABV kind of dries out the palate, which makes the sip very short-lived, uh, and, and you want to go right back in for another one. The carbonation with this is getting up towards medium. The body is on the lower end of medium at a 10% ABV beer. This drinks very light um, for what it is. This is an incredible Scotch Ale. Really nice. If you like malty beers, chances are you've had a Scotch Ale before. Well, the bourbon barrel aging and the addition of the mushroom caps and the maple syrup really take it to the next level. This is borderline world class. I'm not going to go quite world class, but it's definitely a solid eight. Getting up there, I'm going to go with a 97 out of 100. I think this is a most excellent beer. I would definitely recommend it if you can get the Sugar Hill, uh, Sugar Moon bourbon barrel aged maple scotch ale in your area from Hobbs Brewing Company out of New Hampshire. It is definitely worth a purchase. Absolutely incredible. Thanks so much again to Bumpy Road for providing me with this beer. I really appreciate it. Mm. Really good stuff. My phone is dinging over there, so sorry for that. So yeah, 97 out of 100. Thanks again to Bumpy Road Brewery. Link in the description below as well as right there. You can click on his icon and get to his channel that way. Hope you're all having a wonderful day. And until next time, everybody, cheers.